the Senior Bowl always sees some major risers. Last year, we saw Houston wide receiver Tank Dell take a massive leap after he dominated in the one-on-ones and ended up being taken in the third round. All week, we are going to be talking about some of the players who I think really helped their draft stock. And the first guy we will be discussing is Mizzou edge slash defensive tackle Darius Robinson. Robinson may have had the best week of anyone at the Senior Bowl, and not only is he flying up draft boards, but he is also getting potential first round buzz, which is absolutely incredible. This is a player I have been high on since I studied him in November, but seeing him this high has been incredibly refreshing. So today, we will be discussing how high I think he should go, and ultimately, his strengths and weakness. If you guys are new to the channel, consider hitting that like and subscribe button and leave a comment and let me know which players you guys would like to see me touch on in the next one, but without further ado, let's get into it. Robinson has been at Mizzou for a few seasons and his production has increased each and every year for the Tigers. In 2022, Robinson finished with 10 hurries, 6 hits, and 3 sacks, playing alongside Isaiah McGuire. He wasn't a player many were expecting to be a high draft pick and prior to the Senior Bowl, he was widely considered an early day 3 guy. His 2023 production was fantastic, as he finished with 27 hurries, 6 hits, and 9 sacks on the year, and he showed some really high potential, especially as a pass rusher. In the one-on-one period in Mobile, he dominated. He was the only player who seemed to be winning just about every rep. He beat Tyler Guyton multiple times, who was another guy who had a very solid week, and he showed some elite moves and elite potential, and I think he's going to continue to fly up draft boards, similar to what we saw from Lucas Van Ness last year. Robinson is an extremely versatile player on the defensive line, and in large parts, it is due to his size. He measured in at 6'5", 286 pounds, which is really fantastic for an edge rusher. But Robinson is not strictly an edge rusher, which is what makes him so unique. He also has the potential to play on the inside, and he lined up in a number of different spots along that Mizzou defensive line, and he dominated. At the 3-tech position, he had a 13% pass rush win rate. In 5-tech, he had an 18.8% pass rush win rate. In wide 9, he had a 19% win rate. Not only can he play anywhere, he can dominate in any place on your defensive line. Robinson is a fantastic pass rusher. And it goes further than just the numbers. He has a number of fantastic pass rush moves that he was able to mix in and utilize, and on top of that, he is a very good athlete. He has an elite burst and quick first step off the line of scrimmage, which I love to see, but he showcased an elite swim move, he could spin, and he also has the size to just power through you. His hands never stopped moving, and he leveraged himself incredibly well. He showcased these skills in Mobile repeatedly, and the buzz just got louder and louder every time he took a snap, and he showed some elite potential as a pass rusher. I also really loved what Robinson did setting the edge in the run game. He did a great job of crashing down, closing the gap, and he had the length and the size to wrap up and make a tackle. I really like his versatility, and I think he brings a lot to the table. There isn't a lot to not be in love with when it comes to Darius Robinson. He's strong, he's quick, he's versatile, and he has great size, but like every NFL player, he does have some weaknesses. Robinson plays an aggressive brand of football, and it did cause him to stumble and lose his balance from time to time, and he just looked out of control at times. So I would like to see him play a little bit more reserved and a little bit more controlled. Another area from Robinson that I worry about is he didn't have elite track down speed. His burst and quickness on his first step is elite, but it did feel when he was asked to track down a runner or a quarterback, he did slow down when he had to make a play, so that is another area that I would like to see improve for him. Robinson was a late bloomer, as he didn't have much production prior to 2023, but when he showed what he showed this season, he's well worth the buzz in my opinion. He has flown up my board drastically, coming into the week as my number 15 edge rusher, jumping all the way to my number 6 edge rusher. He is dominant, and I love the versatility that he brings to the defensive side of the ball. He is my number 43 overall player in the class. Robinson is a defensive coordinator's dream. He can play anywhere and everywhere on your defensive line. 
I think he would likely work best as a true edge in a 4-3. When he plays wide over the tackle, he has showed some elite ability to get off the line of scrimmage with his quick first step and wreak havoc on the quarterback. This is where I would put him, but I think you could piece him anywhere on this line, and he's going to make an impact. Robinson received some lofty comparisons at the Senior Bowl, and some of them I agree with. Some compared him with J.J. Watt, which to be honest, isn't awful. When you look at the size comparisons, they are very close. Some compared him with Cam Jordan. Some compared him to Danico Autry. I can see a mixture of all three. In terms of defensive line versatility, all three of these guys fit the bill, but Cameron Jordan is the player that I see the most. He is a dominant pass rusher, and he has been for the last decade. But on top of that, him and Robinson are very similar athletes, they can play anywhere on the defensive line, they're good run defenders, and they can rush the passer. I'm not saying Robinson is going to be a perennial all-pro like Jordan, but in terms of play style, versatility, and size, those two are very similar in my opinion. Darius Robinson is flying up draft boards, and for good reason. He is quick, he is strong, and he has a number of elite pass rush moves in order to get to the quarterback. I think he's going to be an awesome player in the NFL, and ultimately, I believe Darius Robinson will be a first-round pick in the 2024 NFL Draft.